It's Papa Bear. I'm true to this, not new to this. Out here in Cali, uh, headed on up to uh, Washington State right now, trying to do what I do. Um, I was reading the um, Trucker Magazine, the Trucker newspaper, and uh, it made a point on something that I've been telling my boys <laughs> all along. You can't stop the old ways just because you're doing things a new way. Okay? And everything. I would tell my boys to buy a map book. A good map book. Uh, the, the top of the line high dollar, fifty dollar map book. And uh, it will help you in the future when all this technology fails. Which it does fail from time to time. Not saying there's anything wrong with the technology, uh, any wrong, anything wrong with having it. There's nothing wrong with having it. But remember, it's just a tool. And just like with any tool, when it breaks, it's no good. You can't use it and stuff. So uh, it's good to have a backup, your map book in the truck. If you don't have a map book, I suggest you get one. I've always had a map book. I got a map book in here right now that I've had for a few years. Me personally, and this is just my choice. Okay, motor carriers, map book. Okay, this is my choice. The, the brand I use, I've been using for a minute. It, it's been Rand McNally, and, and, and they pretty much been on point in most cases and stuff plus writing down directions to hard places to find and stuff like that um that you can't find in the map book because some places you just are so small you you're not going to locate it unless you got good directions written down and sometimes the gps can't find it um, because um congestion or too many towns in one little area and stuff like that they, they even all with all the mapping that they doing they they don't can't map every little thing they trying but you know sometimes it just don't work not saying the technology you know is very helpful and everything but I remember back in the day when there was no GPS and there was no cell phones <laughs> <coughs> Imagine that, newbies. No GPS and no cell phones. A lot of you would be lost. Okay, right now. Because you can't read a map book. Or you can't read a map at all. I suggest that you get a map book. And um, if you don't know how to read a map, you teach yourself how to read a map. It's real simple. Everything in this map book is here that you need to tell, to show, to tell you um, the information of where to go and where not to go. Okay, and stuff in the map book. Um, I've been telling my boys all along, get a map book. Most of them have got a map book <clears throat> and stuff. And um, hopefully if they need it, it'll help them. And I'm pretty sure that it will. Because the, 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 the map book was doing it for me before this GPS thing came out. And writing stuff down and all that stuff. That's why I still write a lot of stuff down. Even though they send it to me on the Qualcomm, I still write it down. Because I'm used to having something in my hand when I walk in there, and and if I, and and uh, I've tried pulling it up. But if you're inside the shipper or or where you're picking up, and you can't get a good signal, guess what? You're not gonna pull up that information that you need. But if you got it written down, which only takes a few minutes. Everything's right there. Well, pick up number, booking on bill lady number. 
appointment time, the stuff is there. You ain't got to put every de write every detail down, just the important stuff and everything. And it's right there in your hand. That just tells you, you know, you, you, all this technology, you can't replace the power of paper and pen. Just saying, you know, you do it your way, you do it the way you do it. You know what I'm saying? But when you're standing there at the shipper trying to pull up this information on your dial-in or, or whatever format that you're using and it don't come up and yeah, now you're holding everybody else up because your information can't come up and you say oh damn trying to figure it out okay well you the one gonna be sitting there and they're gonna be mad at you okay write it down it ain't gonna hurt you okay the old ways never go away you lose all this technology out here by some very, very remote chance of it happening. But if you lose all this technology out here, guess where we'd be back? We'd be back to the old ways, which man has been surviving on for centuries. We still survive. We just have to revert. But it is what it is. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Hey, this Papa Bear, I'm just, just sitting it out there, you know what I'm saying? You do what you want to do with it, okay? But the the but the the but fact of the matter is, nothing's foolproof, okay? Except good common sense and um, breaking out this map book from time to time. Yeah, I admit I haven't had to break it out that much uh, and stuff. And uh, unless I was in an area where I, I couldn't get a good signal or something like that, and I knew I was close. <clears throat> but uh, uh, over the last uh, over the last few years, I haven't had to break it out much at all. But I'm still going to always buy me an up-to-date map book every few years. Because that's just what I do. I think this one is a 2018 just bought it last year and I still use it it still got worn I still mark off the cities and highlighter and uh, that I go to and stuff when I use it and everything or if I got it in my GPS I'll log it in there <clears throat> and stuff and highlight it or put a star or, 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 or a marker or something that let me know that I've been there to this place before <clears throat> Make sure you use your GPS completely because it can save you a lot of time. Uh, and um, mark the places you've been off in your motor carrier's log, in your motor carrier's atlas. Okay? But um, that's just something to put something out there for the people. This is Papa Bear doing what he's doing to the young man I met last night at the truck stop. You know, it was nice talking to you and everything and nice meeting you. You keep it safe out there. Uh, you only got one more year until you're 21. And you can get, you know, you're just driving in the state of California right now. But be safe and be smart, okay, about how you do your thing, okay? And uh, to my sons out there, I love you. And uh, Papa Bear, Dad, you know, always thinking about you guys. And uh, and uh, I know y'all going to succeed at whatever you're doing, okay? To my grandchildren, I love you. My daughter, I love her. And my mom. Not least of all on the list, I love her too. Okay, because I know she look at these videos from time to time. But anyway, I'm out here doing what I do. This is Papa Bear. I'm true to this, not new to this. <laughs> okay, you see me out there, holler. You know, if you, if you don't, not sure, holler anyway. It might be me, you know what I'm saying? If you see the hat, well, it's probably me. Okay, but y'all have a great day out there. Be safe. And um, be blessed. Peace.